4.1 minutes. That's the average response time it takes members of the city's 140-person volunteer fire department to respond to a fire emergency. It really comes down to uh, saving property and rescuing people. If we get there sooner, we, uh, um, you know, the outcome is going to be much better than if it takes us 10 to 15 minutes to arrive. Firefighters' work is never really done. There are always skills to be learned, improved upon, and practiced. The South Metro Public Safety Training Facility is where Bloomington's fire team works to keep life-saving skills sharp. We don't have a, enough events in, in, in Bloomington where you know we're going to fires every single day and, and, our, and our folks are getting, in, getting that experience. So we have to stay on top of our training. It's very important. If you don't do training, people get hurt at the fire scenes or whatever incident it might be. They get hurt and uh, we, we wouldn't be able to do the job we do. During this weekly training session, two of Bloomington's six fire stations drill at one time on a variety of mock-up scenarios. These could include basement fires, high-rise emergencies, search and rescue, and hose line instruction. During this particular training, a live fire scenario was heating things up. When you go in, you're just going to be, uh, it's going to be very smoky and you're going to be looking for the fire and just practicing those uh, skills that we uh, that we train on to put the fire out. Find the fire, put it out, and then we're gonna add some other things in there, like um, if a firefighter becomes trapped or lost, how, how do we rescue them? Uh, if, if we need to get out of the building in a hurry, uh, say it starts to collapse on us, we're gonna practice evacuating. It's clear that being a firefighter isn't a job to be taken lightly. And just as these men and women train often to prepare for emergency situations, Forrester urges residents to do the same. It's very important to have a safe escape plan out of your house in case of a fire, especially in the middle of the night. Have a, have a meeting place out, out in the yard somewhere and, and, and practice it. If you don't practice it, it's just like practicing here with us. If you don't practice, you're not going to be able to do it during the real thing. Where there's smoke, there is fire. And you can bet in Bloomington, you'll have highly trained emergency response teams doing their best to keep your family and property safe from a blaze.